And there we have it. And there was a foul whistled with 1.3 showing on the clock. It's over. Yeah, so there you have it. Um, I figured I would show a little footage um, of the biggest moments of the game leading up towards the Auburn celebration. Um, it was a very emotional, physical game, hard fought. Auburn just kept swinging. LSU just kept swinging. It's going back and forth. At the end of the third, it was 52 to 51. And I was like, you know what? Um, Auburn... They got a really good chance to try to secure this upset. And in the fourth quarter, just more perseverance. Like I said, very, very tough game, physical, both sides. And, you know, defensive, defensive-minded. And it would just come down to, you know, a few plays of execution late. And even though Angel Reese lost the ball, actually, let me, let me reframe. Let me reframe that. Actually, she had had her cookies snatched. That young player just snatched that rock, said, give me that, you know. And so that was just monumental um, because I really I really don't know. LSU's guard play is so questionable. Um, Haley Van Left shot. What was she? I don't – I didn't look at the stat sheet, but I'm going to say – I know they were talking about she was one for nine. But I think I saw her take two more shots, so I think she was born for 11. Um, in any case, I know she only had one field goal, and this is not the Louisville Haley. This this isn't happy Haley right now, and she's probably the only, pers the only player and person on LSU that I actually like. Um, now, I respect Andrew Reese. Um, but as you guys know, as an Iowa fan, I'm not a fan of LSU. I'm just not. And it's, it's not. I'm not being petty. I just I can't get with the program that took our championship. So, you know, I just can't do it. But in any case, I like to see Haley play much better because this ain't it, guys. Um, Michaela Williams jump shot. I, I don't know if it was flat or what, but it was just it wasn't it wasn't going in. It wasn't dropping for her yesterday. And, you know, depth-wise, this is a team to challenge. Um, they don't have a long rotation at all. Um, could be a trust factor from Kim, Kim Mulkey. Um, ultimately, the only player that was really playing their hardest yesterday was Angel Reese. Angel Reese was laying it on the line, getting physical, showing grit, determination, um, scrapping, getting in there, trying to grab rebounds, um, very spirited. Um, if she just continues to play that way, which is – pretty much how she plays um it, it has to bowl well for them because um if angel reese is doing this everybody else has to follow and get in line um you know and anisa moral is quite the talent um she had a couple of air balls and and, and it happens i'm not saying these players got to play perfect games but um anisa moral was kind of a mixed bag of results yesterday and so um i don't know this this loss isn't too much. Um, hopefully, it does more for Auburn, for their coach Johnny Harris, who I like. Um, she's a really good coach. Um, and then before I go, honesty, honesty, Scott Grayson. I don't know that she's on any WNBA drafts, um, you know, mocks, or I don't even know if she's on any scouts' radars. But the scouts need to be watching honesty, Scott Grayson, because she was unbelievable last night. Um, nice silky jump shot. Um, just a great two-way player, gets after it, um, nice passer, just a really good hard player. And I'm just going to tell you guys that I don't know enough about her, 
But from what I saw in that small sample size, that girl can ball. Um, I know she started out at Baylor, and then she ends up at Auburn. But um, just a key player, just a great player. And to see her just, you know, to let it all out and <laughs> have the ball running down the court, about to celebrate, you know, she had a lot to do with with yesterday's victory as, as much as anybody. But um, I like what they're doing at Auburn. Hopefully they can they can turn this into something um, for their program, you know, to just kind of keep on letting them know they headed in the right direction. I think they're now 12 and 5 on the season. They got their first conference win, so that's big. That was real big for them. Um, again, honesty, Scott Grayson, she can hoop. And with that being said, guys, I'm out.